Yo guys, back at it again with the American Truck Simulator. Here we go. Looks like uh, 6,000 bucks for our newest load that we're going to be doing. We're going to go ahead and get right into it. Um, got a new headset, so or, or got a headset finally. So all you complainers that say I use my, uh, my laptop uh, mic, that is no longer true. So let's go ahead and turn on our lights. Go ahead and turn right here. So let's actually pay attention to the road. All right. So we're going to go ahead and get this load complete. Um, what I really wanted to do was kind of get into Tonopah and stuff like that. Um, I did do a, kind of a review uh, as far as on my mic and just wanted to check out and see how good uh, my mic quality was. So I, I did test it and, and make sure it sounded best. Um, if anything, I would think about boosting it a little bit lower, because uh, you kind of do hear me pretty well. But you know, we'll go ahead and change it. It's it's definitely better than what our quality was before. So we're gonna go ahead and begin to try and. I just want to see something. I want to see. I did do some uh, some new keys, and I wanted to see. Here we go. Yeah, they work. Okay. Because they weren't working um, in episode three, I didn't even say anything about it because I didn't know if they were gonna work. But oh, we're gonna go ahead and have a red light here, which is always lovely. So, what I'm hoping for is an episode five to buy our own truck or get very close to it. Been making um, a lot of runs, a lot of money, so it's it's time we finally get a truck. Um, yeah. I feel like sometimes um, in this game you literally go through the same towns even though there's different names. It's, it's kind of like they they basically just uh, copied the same setting because I feel like this is like kind of a version of Tonopah. I don't know why. I just feel that way. Reminds me of Tonopah. Okay. What up trucking buddy? How you doing? Who do you want to win for president? The Trump Stonator? I don't know, guys. This year, um, I'm feeling like Trump's going to win. Uh, I, I'm, I honestly believe uh, he's going all the way. So, I mean, I really can't see Hillary Clinton uh, winning. I mean, she, she's kind of got a lot of dirt on her. Um, she's kind of fake in some ways. But, you know, everyone's got their opinion, so, you know, I, I, I uh, in my honest opinion, if it was Hillary Clinton or Donald Trump, I, I'd like to see the Trumpinator win. But, you know, that's just me. Not to start any trouble, but, you know. All right. It's 11 p.m., but guess what? We got a whole bunch of trucking to do. Nine hours and 31 minutes, in fact. Right, let's make sure we don't hit anybody. I know the last few episodes uh, we've been good about it. That's just an episode one thing. I wish uh, with uh, these GPSs uh, that we actually, um, you know, could uh, you know, spin and, and be like sophisticated like we are in the real world. I don't understand why it's like pointed down like that. Kind of confuses me. I almost thought I missed my turn when I was looking at the GPS uh, there. But that's okay. All right, let's do it. A little bit of horn going on. Where's our speeding tickets? I haven't been getting any. I'm surprised. And I am uh, indeed re recording this on uh, Friday, uh, March 18th. So I'm guessing you guys will probably see this Sunday night not Saturday. Um, I'm going to try and do the editing tonight and get it uploaded tomorrow. Oh, I don't know why my steering wheel is jerking back and forth like that. Um, but, yeah, I'm, I'm actually going to do a bloopers video probably tonight. I've been trying to upload uh, every other day um, and get some videos posted. A bunch of people are already like uh, the episode, you know, 15 to 20. Um, and I'm only episode 5, I think, 4. Uh, so, uh, yeah. 
gotta get gotta get some more videos rolling, you know. But and I've also thought about adding some music um, to games uh, or, or recordings, um, basically shutting up for you know five or ten minutes of the uh, recording and, and basically playing some low music, or possibly playing some low music um, with me talking. I don't know how good that turned out, but it's an idea, so let me know what you think in the comments. I'm really surprised. We have not got one speeding ticket. Uh, 78 miles an hour, and uh, not one cop has uh, been out. But I'll probably jinx it. There'll probably be a cop coming up here. I mean, we're, we're about to be doing 80 miles an hour. There's got to be one cop that is out here. Like, this will amaze me. Maybe it's because it's 1237. I don't know. So, hopefully everyone had a great week. I know I got spring break next week. I'm, I mean, spring break. I, I usually, I'm so happy when it's a week long. Um, I used to live in Las Vegas. So it used to be a week long, uh, but li now I live in Jersey, uh, and unfortunately it's not uh, a week long here. It's about four days, so can't really complain, but can't really be too excited because you can't really go on vacation anywhere when you only got you know four days off. about everyone else but I feel like this route's actually going pretty quick we're almost to five and a half hours we started off at nine and a half hours haven't got one speeding ticket not one not one single speeding ticket now see if we were playing uh, like we were in episode uh, three we would have been getting ticket after ticket after ticket Hope we don't flip over here. I could totally get lost in that thing because uh, they have them in Jersey right there in Pennsylvania. The uh, them like figure eight things, and I remember one time I was going to like a uh, a dance or something, and uh, I went to. Uh, get off and I actually got the same I actually went on the opposite way than I was coming to get onto it so it's pretty confusing if you don't pay attention 191 miles oh there we go back at it again with the speeding tickets that's what I'm talking about we're on the road again I'm running out of fuel are you kidding me did the employer or the guy put any fuel in my truck? Oh, boy. Yeah, we are running out of fuel. We're going to need to hit a uh, gas station here. we got got uh, 99 miles to go. And uh, we got 188 miles uh, of travel. So we're going to have to hit up a gas station. Hopefully we find one uh, nearby here. What a school bus is doing at 2:22 a.m. Kind of suspicious on a Sunday. Going to pick up people, huh? Huh? Is that what you're doing? I love how AI like never honks at you unless you're blocking traffic at a stop. That's like the only way they ever honk at you. But if you cut them off right now, they don't do anything. They just go with the flow. We really need fuel because we're really running out of it if we run out of fuel that won't be good yep here comes a gas station let's hit that up boy all right let's go 
ahead and get some gas and then we will get right back on the road. When is it expecting us for arrival? Sunday at 5.05. Okay. And I'm going to pull in the other way because we're going to have to get back. Let's go ahead and fill up the truck. I don't really need to go that far, so I'm, I'm just gonna bring it to 300 and uh, we're gonna hit the road. Oh, here we go, we're good. Alright, so let's go ahead and start the truck back up. lucky on that one we almost hit the guy I, I if I didn't hear his truck noise I would have probably hit him all right 106 miles let's hit this road boy see it would have been more convenient to just hit the gas station right here we would have probably you know got on the road quicker but sometimes you can't look ahead can't look back on the decision we, we make. Come on. You're going way too slow. Oh, shut the lights off. Gets a little gets a little scary. I didn't even keep my turn signal on there. Alright, 82 miles. Let's see if we're going on like any cool dirt pass or anything. I doubt it. Just always riding on the highway. That's the only trips I ever get. I don't get any cool ones. San Diego I don't think I don't I don't really even know where we're actually going but we'll figure it out I want to get there before six o'clock you know I was kind of thinking about it if you average it in like when you're driving how many speeding tickets you get for the extra bonus money of what you could save to get there quicker um, especially if you do like the the fuel uh, thing where if you're doing like 60 miles an hour you pump on cruise control you get more to a gallon obviously um, if you go like over the speed limit and you get speeding tickets and you average it in I, I don't really think it'd be much different um, if you didn't do that and you just took the uh, the loss of not getting the bonuses because I didn't realize speeding tickets like 650, 400, and you get them in a few times. See, they're like 12. There you go. So I, I'm basically $1,200 in my own pocket out of this route, haven't even got paid. So it's kind of crazy. Think about. So glad that you didn't just pull me over, which is shocking. All right. So let's go ahead and throw in our flashers. Let's see where this guy wants this delivered. Hopefully it's somewhere easy that I can actually do. Because there is a uh, lot of difficult parking uh, strategies. Yeah, let's, uh, let's hope I can do it.
Oop, didn't mean to turn on parking. Uh, damn crates got in the way. Alright, disconnecting that trailer. That's what I'm talking about. Alright. Level 7. We're going to go ahead and hit the... Uh, see, 15%, 5 more for valuable ivory. We're going to go ahead and do uh, long distance. Upgrade that one. Alright, so we have $70,000. We really like need to start deciding. Are we going to get a truck? Are we not going to get a truck? What are we going to do? Because... I really can't see us not getting a truck. I mean, we need one. So... Really like any of these jobs right now though it's pretty boring why don't you just travel from Crescent City that way and these jobs don't make sense but gotta do them anyways because that's our job all right so we've done a lot of bars still in Sacramento and El Centro that kind of stuff we, we gotta start gotta start moving in this way so, we're going to go ahead and take this job. Take this job right here. And we're going to go ahead and start it. I probably won't be able to finish it in this video, but it's okay. Oh, uh, yeah, these are the kind of trucks I like. Just a normal day cab driving along. Oh, God, no. Can't go down there. Of course, they don't put any do not enter signs or anything. I mean, what if you don't even know? Like, what? That's so stupid. I don't understand why they bother. What's with all the barriers? Alright. So I hope this is the way to get out because I really don't know. Yep. Mm -hmm. Thanks for making it very difficult, sir. Bye bye. All right. So let's get on our way to Oc Ockdale or whatever the heck. Uh, Oc whatever. I don't even know. But it's fine. Let's get ahead and get a turn in here. No, you no, buddy. Sorry. Oh my gosh. Couldn't get the lumber in there any any tighter. Any tighter, right? Well, guys, we're almost at uh, 20 minutes for the video, so I'm going to go ahead and end it. I hope you enjoyed this episode 4. Um, definitely a huge surprise to come uh, next video. Um, so let me know what kind of trucks you guys think I should buy or what truck you think I should buy um, as far as with the game. And hopefully I will uh, buy the truck you'd like to see. Um, like I said, hopefully by next episode I will have a truck and we will be uh, doing a solo run after this run. I uh, appreciate you guys watching and like and subscribe. And Hope if everybody runs, you choose to stay. Hope that you fall in love and it hurts so bad.